Hi, I'm Christy Wilhelmy of GardenNerd.com, and this is an answer to the question of how do I tend my cucumbers? So, the first thing, of course, is that you want to plant your cucumbers in loose, friable, nutrient-rich soil. They are heavy feeders, which means they use up a lot of nitrogen and phosphorus as they grow. So make sure you amend your soil with plenty of organic matter and compost. Um, the second thing you need to know about it is give them a place to climb. Yes, you can grow cucumbers without trellising them, but you'll have more garden space and it's more efficient and it stays out of the dirt more if you do give them a place to climb. Use a sturdy trellis, like this metal one here, or um, some others that have bamboo or mesh netting, which um, allow them to grab on with their tendrils to the trellis and climb upward. Water regularly. When you water your cucumbers, they like to have moist soil but not wet soil, so they don't like wet feet, so don't let them get soggy. Uh, let the soil dry out in between waterings and make sure that they stay wet enough so that they can grow. The next thing you need to know is that cucumbers will pollinate themselves, but sometimes they need a little help. Some people will hand pollinate. And they basically take a little paintbrush and they take pollen from the male flowers and put them on the female flowers. And I'll show you an example of what that looks like right here. So a male flower, where are you? It has a long stem like this underneath it. And then it has the flower. Whereas the female flower is right up against the leaf and the cucumber is actually starting to form already with the flower on the end. And that's going to open, but it hasn't yet. So you can pollinate from male to female and help ensure uh, healthy production. Uh, another thing that people do when your cucumbers reach the top of the trellis is pinch the tips off. So then it actually triggers further growth down below and it branches out, gets bushier, and produces more fruit. So there's one more thing that you can do to ensure um, good pollination and a healthy garden in general, and that's to plant beneficial flowers around the perimeter of your plants. So nasturtiums are good for that, alyssum, and marigolds. And you can plant umbels, which flower, when they flower, the flower forms an umbrella shape, and that attracts parasitic wasps and other critters that eat aphids, which we all like. So other umbels include things like dill, parsley, and cilantro. So use these healthy tips to grow cucumbers and tend to them well. I'm Christy Wilhelmy from GardenNerd.com.